I got into AI because this is like the coolest problem. The top scientists in AI have many opportunities. They're going to go where they have the opportunity to have the maximum impact. And FAIR provides that kind of an environment. My research focuses on AI for imperfect information games. So these are games not like chess or go, where both players know the exact state of the world, but more like games like poker or negotiations, for example, where there might be hidden information that you have access to that your uh, partner or adversary doesn't see, and vice versa. Being able to work on problems that nobody else knows the answer to, that nobody else even understands that well, uh, is just really exciting for me. So we're in a kind of golden age for, for AI today to help people connect with each other, to understand content, things like that. There's a lot of useful applications of AI, so much so that uh, Facebook is built around AI today. There was a unique opportunity in creating an organization which would have a very ambitious long-term scientific goals, but at the same time would have a big impact on the world. This is what makes Facebook AI unique. You have this freedom, but when you create something valuable, you also have a path to see it having an impact in products that have, are being accessed by billions of users. It really pays off to have these partnerships with different product teams. Our algorithms for similarity search, which were developed in FAIR, are now deployed across the platform and dealing with millions, if not billions, of images every day. When you come here, you know that you're going to be able to work with the best tools, the best infrastructure, and the best colleagues as well. We have the people who are inventing the AI of tomorrow.